I've been trying to adjust this camera. <laughs> but I think I broke it officially. Wait, we might not be able to film because listen, this brightness, bro. Anyway, y'all, let's get into the story time. Okay, so, by the way, I'm sitting on my bed. I haven't did a video on my bed in a minute, but I'm eating some tacos that I made, and I got some street corn, okay? I went to Vegas for my birthday, for my 23rd birthday. It was lit. I'm looking for something to open. It's something about that burn. Oh, I'm not gonna, hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, I'm not finna eat cute for this video, I'm hungry. So anyway, like I said, we in Vegas. I'm gonna give you a little backstory. So, it's me, my cousin, and her three friends. I wanna say like Halloween day, I realized I don't have my costume that I packed. And I'm going to try to insert a picture so y'all can see my original costume. If you follow me on Instagram, if you don't, it's going to be in that corner right there. Um, follow me. But, I had to change my costume because I'm looking, I'm looking through my suitcase. Now, why did I check my suitcase on Halloween for my costume? That was so dumb. But I swore I packed it. It was like the first thing I packed. I was so excited. I spent like eight dollars on this costume, right? So, damn fashion over. I'm looking, I'm looking at my suitcase. I'm like, yo, Chloe, it's not in this drum. She's like, all right. Well, we have a lot of cute stuff. We can like kind of switch it up. So I'm like, all right. So we we found a store near our hotel. We stayed at the Hard Rock. And I think this one was called Hottie. Yeah, it was called Hottie. And I was like, all right, they got some cute stuff in here. And I found this like green robe, like a little chem robe, right? With the little, it was it was green and long and mesh with the little tie around. But it had the little furry sleeves. It's real popping. I'm gonna insert a picture so y'all can see. stripper heels I was like dang I should wear it together and I could be like a little hustler like a little stripper or like a pimp it ended up looking cute I straightened my hair and it came together like it was popping so my cousin is like doing her makeup and I fell asleep on the bed the reason I fell asleep on the bed because we had been drinking and I was just faded so I was like bro I need a nap whole time i'm like sleep but i'm like stressed i'm like oh my god i'm gonna bust my ass in these hills oh i love these stripper hills so i'm gonna bust my ass in these hills if you don't know what hills i'm talking about go to my instagram right here like pause this video like pause pause the video and go to my instagram so you can see my hills because the pictures i took in that hotel room were fire oh oh i'm gonna bit my finger off my cousin Playing music in the back. I'm like, who's at home? Your friend be like, girl, you got it. Like, you could do it. But you be in your head like, mm -mm, I can't do it. She finally ready. It's time for us to go. We got to go to Club Dreas. It's like a real big nightclub in, um, in Vegas. But she got to be on the guest list. But my cousin already took care of that. So he's already on the guest list, baby. But that ain't me now. Because look. When we pulled up, it was mad people. But as soon as we walked in the lobby, they ran into some YouTubers. So, I was like, we didn't know what was going on. Because me and my cousin, we were so busy looking for the line. Like, yo, where we get, how we get in this club? We trying to get in the club. Because the thing was, it wasn't just no regular Halloween party, you know, little night or whatever. It, like, 
DJ Pauly D, DJ Pauly D, like Jersey Shore DJ Pauly D was DJing. So I'm like, oh yeah, honey, we gotta be on time time. Okay, we gotta be on time time. We following a little YouTube girl and we see the line. So I was like, bet. So as we about to walk to the line, we realize you ever go somewhere and it's a line and you only see part of the line and you like, Shh, that ain't nothing. Then you peek the rest of the line, like, you be like, oh, 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 oh. So it's <clears throat> mad people, like, it literally, like, almost a uh, 150 people already in line. And so we like, what they in line for, though? Because we on a gas list, so, like, is it a difference? So, as we all talking about it, some guy who is running the little, like, you gotta walk past the door because the line go all the way around the casino now. The door is to get in and the security right there. So we like, okay. what's going on? We see people being checked. So this guy dressed up like a ringleader is like, hey ladies. And so me and my cousin looking like, hello. He like, y'all on the guest list? We like, and it's like, you know how you're not from somewhere, so you don't know if something legit or not. We look at him like, like, you can't be taking the tickets, buddy. Like, you can't, buddy. No, sir. But he's that dude. He's like, oh, if y'all, uh, y'all was on, y'all signs me on the guest list and be like, yeah. He's like, oh, y'all can come straight through here. We like, say what? So, we really walking towards him and... I'm like, we gonna figure out if he really who he say he is when we get up here. Like, for real. As soon as we get up there, it was like, cool, like, let me see y'all little, you know how your ticket be to get in a club on your phone. And we showed them, they're like, great, cool, y'all in. Go ahead and like, and they, and they start asking about money, like, did y'all pay for this? Because sometimes you gotta pay. It's weird, it's real weird, like, how the clubs work in Vegas. Like, you gotta be dressed a certain way, you have to pay for certain things just to get in the club. Like, ugh. So... I look back, and my cousin friends back there, I'm like, what's going on? Like, they didn't know that they was with us. So I'm like, whoa. I'm the type of person, like, if I go somewhere, I came with a group of people, that's who I'm rocking with. I'm not going to see my way in the club and leave you at the door. Mm -mm. Like, we a group. So I'm like, oh, they were us. Like, what's going on? So they're like, oh, okay, well, they had them do something and they let them come with us. So we're like, all right, right, cool. So we finally in there. I'm stoked because it's like, this is supposed to be the hottest club in Vegas. When I tell y'all, we get through the security and you gotta take an elevator just to get to the club. I'm like, oh, for real? Nice. So we get on the elevator with all these different people. And it kind of seemed like we was one of the first people to get in there, but I didn't want to be too hyped. It was decorated so dope though, like it was crazy. And so we went to do that, we went to take pictures, and then when we walked in there, club wasn't packed, but everybody was at the bar. Like when we figured out where the bar was, everybody was at the bar. But this club was huge, y'all. This room was so big. <laughs> Keep in mind, I'm saying this because when I get to what happened, whoo, oh, level up here, it's the floor, level up here, this is the floor, and in between those levels is sections like that curve around, and then the DJ is right in the center, and right under the DJ booth or whatever that's up on stage is the dance floor. So like that's where the majority of the people want to be because they want to be near Pauly D, and that's where we was going. So we was like. We're going to get these drinks, which took forever to get, y'all. And then, we're going to head to the floor. I was walking.
walking in my heels. Like walking to the Uber and all that. I started to get my rhythm. So I'm like, oh, I could do this heel thing. You say nothing. And stripper heels really comfortable. Like for real. Matter of fact, they right here. These shoes right here, okay? Stripper heels is really comfy because of this platform. It kind of like supports the ball of your foot. But, honey, it's still a heel. So, I'm like, okay, I'm going crazy. I need another drink because it's wearing off. So, we go get to the bar and get another drink. I think I had a Long Island iced tea. Long Islands, I forgot, have multiple liquors in them. And, like, I felt like it was just, like, tequila and brown and vodka all in my head. I'm like, yo, I'm really faded, like. And so, at one point or another, I don't know how this happened, but my cousin and her friends went one way, and me and one of her other friends went another. So, like, we lost each other. Like, we couldn't figure out where the other one was. So, we're like, we're dancing because it's like, we're still drunk. So, it's like, we know that they're not with us right now, but at the same time, it's not urgent to go find them. Like, we feel like they're good. They're straight. I text my cousin, like, hey, where y'all at? And she's like over in the bathroom so cool i was dancing already because i was like like you know holding the girl's hand because we're making our way to the bathroom now like we've partied a little bit now we're trying to go find my cousin and her friends and her other friends so me and the girl are walking like don't stop pop it and i'm i'm holding her hand but i'm behind her so we're walking we're walking we're walking and i'm dancing how to get to the bathroom this is the little map okay the equalities right here this is the party floor the sections are this way and there's a like a, a a lane where it separates the party floor from the people in their sections and they're all standing up on their sofas in their sections of course so we're walking through that little lane but it's kind of tight and i'm following her and i'm dancing i'm literally faded walking like this y'all don't like whatever whatever's playing y'all know the little club music they're like think, 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 blah, blah, blah. whatever <laughs> so i walk in and i'm like just faded i'm feeling the music or whatever and i heard that beat don't stop pop that don't i'm like drop that pussy that's what you said what i got you so <laughs> we're walking we're walking i'm walking behind her she doesn't even peep I literally stop because I cannot like I'm just loving this song and as I'm walking past her I'm looking at the people in the section it's like old like white guys and stuff and they're like you look so good one guy yo I yo this had me rolling because I really wasn't expecting this this guy started digging in his pocket and then he asked his friend like yo give her some money like she need the money give her some money I'm like yes give me the money like give me the money so I'm yelling so the people in the sections the other girls are looking and so it's like a really big section full of girls and guys and stuff like that and so i'm walking i'm walking i'm walking that song is just like consuming me like i'm like don't stop how's that and it was like i just let go of the girl's head like i just let it go and i was like no i gotta dance like i just felt it <laughs> i just felt i felt the energy like i just i just we gotta put this on yes yeah, i was just like this I was giving it my all it was like the hustler that i dressed up for i mean the hustler that i dressed up as for halloween like came through me her spirit like they say that halloween is um uh in a mexican culture el dia de muertos day of the dead so it was like a dead hustler came through me and i was like but it was really just the alcohol there i was mixing <laughs> I started dancing so hard and I didn't notice because the floor was black like Dre's whole club is black you know people drop drinks all the time so where I started dancing was a spilled drink it was either spilled drink spilled water I don't know but there was liquid on the floor I had no idea because I wasn't looking down I'm twerking don't stop pop that and fell like I felt my heel give out 
<laughs> and my ankle. You know them little videos where the <laughs> the bottom be walking and her ankles. <laughs> Mind you, there's a, like, what's that black thing called that keeps everybody in line? It's one of those behind people. So, the people dancing in front of me on the dance floor, they don't see me because their backs are towards me. But everybody in the section is basically here. Like, they're the black part of this bed. So, they're behind me and they see me fall. So, it went from, hey, hey, because they were recording me twerking. Like, everybody just stopped and was like, yo, her outfit, everything, record her. So they were recording me twerking and then I fell. So they're almost like, oh, like, like it all went from A to O, like real fast. And I, this is the funniest part about it. When I fell, the girl didn't even realize. So she's still walking forward. And so like, I think somebody told her to turn around. So she sees me, she's like, yo, what happened? She's trying to help me up, like help me get up. And the floor so slippery, like I literally can't stand. And, and I'm drunk. So like my, my feet are just everywhere. <laughs> like I'm doing splits, half splits. Like I literally was like, yo, if I don't get up this time, I'm gonna break my ankle. Like literally I needed to get up. I couldn't get myself together and the floor was so slippery. And a security guard was like, what y'all doing? Like, why y'all standing here? He wasn't even trying to be, like, compassionate. Like, sir, I am drunk. He would stop even saying me and mind. He's like, what y'all doing right here? Y'all need to move. Y'all either gonna go this way or y'all gonna go back where y'all came from. So, I'm like, okay. So, I get back up. And everybody's like, oh, like, she got back up. Guess what? You would think I fell again, but no. Start twerking again. The song was still going. I forgot all about the trip to the bathroom. Like my cousin and her friends don't even know about this. Somewhere there's a video of a purple hair, purple and blonde haired girl with a green robe on and some money pants dancing in a club after she just fell. If y'all ever find that video, send it to me. Cause I don't even remember. I don't even know what happened. So uh, like, I don't even like, it probably looks so crazy. Like maybe she's on drugs <laughs> and my camera. It's about to die, so I hope y'all enjoyed this um, Vegas story time. Y'all voted for it on my Instagram story, so follow me on Instagram. If you don't already follow me, if you're new to my channel, subscribe. And if you always been watching my videos, you might as well subscribe. If you're not already, like this com um, like this comment. Like, comment, and share. Um, I don't know what else to say. Thank you for watching. Um, I'm going to get my camera fixed. And... Yeah. <laughs>